Hi, this is Theo from Parablox.com. Today I want to show you this sketchbook by Nina Johansson. This is called Drawing Around Sagrada Familia. Nina Johansson is an artist from Sweden. She lives in Stockholm and she's a visual arts teacher, illustrator and sketcher. This book was published in 2013 and I bought it in Spain while I was there. So let's take a look at what's inside. Sagrada Familia is a Roman Catholic church located in Barcelona, Spain. It's designed by the Catalan architect Antoni Gaudi. Construction began in 1882 and when I was in Barcelona in 2013, it's still under construction, but it's almost done and just needs another decade or two. So these sketches are drawn by Nina Johansson on location. Her style is that of uh, pen, ink and watercolor. Sometimes she likes to use color pencils for the lines and in this case um, blue, I think ink lines. If, yeah, ink lines. I like her style very much. It's very, um, very illustrative. She likes to use these letters, a lot of graphic elements. Uh, she's a graphics design teacher as well. She teaches um, web design as well as graphic design, illustration. This is the church from, I don't know which park this is. I'm not sure if I can remember this. This is a nice way to depict a very tall structure. I love the lamps there. These are so intricate and detailed. All these sketches are made around the church, the neighborhood. This is one side of the church showing the four towers. I actually went inside the church and I felt like visiting a castle instead. It, remind, it reminded me of all those um, old Final Fantasy games that I played. The castles with hidden rooms and stuff like that. This is the queue outside. Uh, people waiting to buy the tickets. If you are going to Sagrada Familia, you should buy the tickets online and collect the tickets there so you don't have to queue for one hour around the block. I love the colors that she uses and also uh, she sometimes uses uh, hatching marks to create more uh, tonal values for the sketch. Even simple black and white sketches looks pretty Pretty nice. These are color pencil sketches. Very beautiful lettering. I think I need to um, start writing some letters, um, typography in my sketchbook as well. It's very inspiring. Inspiring to look at um, sketchbooks from other artists. You can learn a lot from them. You can tell that she's a very patient and neat sketcher who always paint uh, the colors within the lines themselves but they, she also allows uh, gradations uh, to come through in watercolors. This is inside the church at the top of the church, the ceiling. Her use of her use of colors is very well well controlled. It's a bit I would say doubt down, but the colors work very well in harmony with one another. That's the architect himself, Antonio Gaudi. See, I like these um, gradations going on. Even for the clouds, you can see it's sort of 
it fades to the white sometimes you get the hard edges sometimes it just fades very softly gently into the white For motorbikes are the most difficult things to draw for me and I think she handles it uh, in such a simple style very nice This is a mixed media drawing, I think. Color pencil, color pencil and ink. Looking at these sketches really brings me back to uh, visiting the place two years ago. Some of the souvenirs selling at the shops there. And when you're in Barcelona, be careful of pickpockets. There are a lot of pickpockets there. While I was there, several friends actually got their stuff stolen. Look at all the hatching lines. These are the sculptures just at the front entrance. Wow, a very beautiful um, scene. Is this drawn from the top? I'm not sure. Oh, this is drawn from Park Well, yeah. This is another um, project by Antoni Gaudi. This is actually drawn from Park Guel, looking at Sagrada Familia from afar. Oh, yeah. And the book is actually in English. So all the text that you see here, these are actually written in English. But it's also um, written, they have text for, I think, Spanish as well. And I think this one is either French or something. The book is published in Spain, so I'm very sure that it's Spain. I cannot make out what the other language is. Probably French. So these are the small thumbnails of all the sketches um, that I've showed you earlier except that they are accompanied by text in Spanish and French. Oh, actually, it, it's written here that it's in English, Castellano and Catala. So those are the languages um, the text is in. It's a very beautiful sketchbook, uh, 92 pages. I will post a link to my review of it as well as links to where you can buy it online. And you can see more of her artworks on her website. I will post a link to that also in the video description below. And that's all for today's sketchbook feature. If you have any questions, you can ask me in the comment section below. And remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel if you are watching this for the first time because I'll be featuring more sketchbook, drawing tips, and sketching techniques and art product reviews in the future. Thanks and see you next time.